a room that I know has been highlighted and talked about in real, in a really positive way, I should say, is the Bending Wave Room, where you saw the Gerbil loudspeakers, you saw the new Riviera Labs amplifiers and preamplifier from Italy, and of course the Wadax, the quarter of a million dollar Wadax setup. Now, this is a room, okay, I'll say this, this is a room that, full transparency, has never blown me away in the past. And I'm looking at the camera as I say, as I say this. I don't want to be dishonest here. This is a room that in the past, when they showed it with Parasound, Audio Research, and CH Precision, never really checked my boxes, never really made me tap my feet. It simply wasn't there for me. I never felt like it drew me in. I didn't find the dynamics, the incredible expression, perhaps, that my systems have. Again, this is one man's point of view. So when I went into Capital Audio Fest and I started to go through the first floor, of course, I went to see this room. I knew going into this, they had this new Riviera Labs amplifier and preamplifier as part of the conversation, as part of the new setup. Now, the room, in this case, was really nicely treated. And I understand from uh, Elliot Goldman that he had a lot of help. I believe the um, guy who was in charge of the DAC setup was there and Riviera Labs was there. So they all worked together this time around to put together this room in the past. To my understanding, Elliot was doing a lot of the heavy lifting um, and spending days there at a time, which was quite difficult. As you know, he is about 70 years old, I want to say. So it's not easy for someone who's 70 years old um, to do all this level of heavy lifting and die and fine tuning. But he had a lot of help this time setting up the room. And boy, was I in for a surprise. Again, one man's point of view, my opinion. I don't need to fact check this. I don't need to make calls to validate what I'm telling you. I was there. I don't care what others may say. I don't even want to curse here. I want to be very, very professional. And it means nothing what anyone one else has to say. When I sat there, I had zero expectations. Sitting there, I thought I was going to get the same, the same feeling, okay, that I have received from this system in the past. And I was completely wrong. And I'm going to attribute this to two things. One, the setup, the room was better, okay? And two, Riviera Labs. Those are the biggest variables that stuck out to me. Now, if there were more changes, perhaps they were not, I was not told there were more things that happened. But I didn't see anything else that stood out to me. These Riviera Lab, Riviera Labs components from, from uh, Italy, the hybrid design amplification and the preamplification, okay, added this much needed musicality added this beautiful harmonic tone it had a lot more airiness on the top end it the system actually reeled me in it talked to me in ways that i don't ever remember um in the past i don't remember this system doing what it did for me okay um, finally finally i connected with the system better there was more emotion okay you can read a lot about this room and different websites and what some of the reviewers from some publications have to say to understand that what I'm saying is essentially what others in the industry were hearing. Okay. So when I was there, I sat there for approximately 30 to 40 minutes because that's the max amount of time that I have, the max amount of time that I have at a show to visit a room. I cannot spend their hours on, on end listening to a system. I got to keep moving if I want to cover everything. For the first time, I can say that I finally connected with this room that when Bendy Wave put together. I am saying this is their best performance ever. They beat themselves. They beat the previous versions of their systems. So this is why I felt I needed to highlight. For the first time, I feel like they are on track. I can finally say, okay, I got something special. My recommendation to Elliot was to try as hard as possible, and I know it's going to be hard, Try to replicate what they did in Capital Audio Fest. 